Realizing that the victim had children at home and watching him in the hospital bed after the surgery and his concern for his family and to be able to see his children. And so it was a combination that made that concern into a reality that he will see his children. And it was based on the people you see to the right and the left. It was a combination of an employee who subdued the person who was responsible for the attack. It was a combination of the early arrival of our EMS specialist, Ms. Rivera and her team, and FDNY. It was a combination of Lutheran Medical Center and the doctors who provided the service. So it was a combination of good Brooklynites coming together to ensure that we're standing here today and you are here with your wife and children. We need to commend them uh, for that. And I say thank you as the borough president, and the people of the borough of Brooklyn say thank you as well. Uh, this incident happened on Monday, September 22nd. It was at the construction site right down the block from here at 172 Montague Street. Uh, Mr. Hershey Pfeiffer was attacked by an employee. Uh, Mr. Pfeiffer suffered, suffered several stab wounds, including one to his neck, which was life-threatening and required major sur surgery and substantial care to save his life. And including that care was Dr. Asher, who's here uh, today with us. <laughs> After the stabbing, the ledge attack and fled the scene and was chased, by, chased down by construction manager, Marcel Alberti. Whereas 
rabbi how beautiful it was. But he said, I don't have any tears left. I've been at so many funerals the last couple of weeks. I have no more tears. He was just shut up. He was just shut down. A few minutes later, all over the garden, you know, there's a lot of screens all over the garden to watch what's going on in the courts. And they slowly, very, very slowly, began to show pictures of heroes from the police department, from the fire department, the heroes of New York, much like we have here today. Very slowly, pictures of men and women, heroes that died on September 11th were shown on the screens of the garden. And suddenly, one particular picture of a firefighter appeared on the screen, and it was silent. At that moment, there was a little girl that cried out, Daddy! And you can imagine, there was not a dry eye in the whole Madison Square Garden.